during which I spent a lot of time working on constituency matters and, um... <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> I went to Barbados and it was bloody brilliant. It was brilliant. It was brilliant. I'm a, I'm a man in love. I'm a man in love. I'm in love. I'm desperately, desperately in love with Regina. 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 Just let it roll around your tongue. Regina. Regina. Apparently it's Latin. It means vagina. I don't know. She's just... I don't know how to say this and still be PC, but um, she's, uh, she's local, let's say. <laughs> she's a uh, dark-haired. And, uh, yeah, she's... I don't want to focus too much on her breasts, but, um... So I won't. I won't. I won't do that. <clears throat> uh, she's amazing. She's made The day we met, the very first day we met, I took her for a moonlight walk. And, uh, <laughs> well, we could just say, uh, my bed didn't need to be made in the morning. <laughs> Which is fortunate, because uh, she's the maid. Uh, so that saved her a job. Now, many of you uh, may remember that last year I lost my wife. Tragically. Uh, but, in fairness, poker is a difficult game. If I didn't know the rules, I should not have been playing. Uh, obviously it wasn't all fun and games. On this holiday I spent a lot of it thinking about fracking and exploratory boreholes and areas of, of immense natural beauty. Cordrilla? Yeah, I would. I would repeatedly under a moonlit sky with her hips lit by the flickering flames of a citronella candle meant to keep away the mosquitoes. But it doesn't. It doesn't. Apparently I'm really quite allergic to mosquito bites. <laughs> Especially in the scrotal area. Blew up to the size of a watermelon. A not particularly appetising watermelon. Still, she spat the seeds out of both. So... She's changed my life. She's changed me. I... I met her family. Uh, we talked, we drank rum, I played with her nephews and nieces on the beach, we collected stones and pieces of coral. And I learned that life is short, life is short, life is too short for hate. Life is too short for greed, life is too short for selfishness, I'm, ta I'm taking off the tie. I don't need the tie anymore. Life is too short. And so I proposed, I proposed. And she said... She said she'd think about it, and and this morning I got I've got this. <clears throat> Dear Ian, that's what she called me. I hope this letter finds you well. It does. It does. Every night since you left, I have dreamed of your face, fat like a broken pillow, covered in tears. I only actually cried the once, you know, at the point of emission. Ever since school, I've always wept at the moment of completion. Not mine back then, Mr. Jeffries is the geography teacher, but, you know, he died, eventually. <clears throat> I love you, Ian. I love every part of you, from your tiny eyes your tiny brain, your nose like a half-digested plantain, and your cheeks upper and lower. I love you, and it would be an honour to be your wife. But I have seen the vans that travel your country, telling immigrants to go home. I've seen your border police stopping people in the street to see if they are there legally. I have read your beloved Daily Mail. Ian, I love you, but we can never be together. Not in your Britain. I will always, always...
Next time let's talk about something funny, shall we? Something like Syria. <laughs>